Here's a demo of some free payroll software. You can find the download of it uh, below the uh, picture of the software. Uh, it's uh, started this way. We open Microsoft and there is the accountant's friend Windows Desktop Payroll 2020. We use a demonstration here. And OK. And there's the main screen of WinPay 2020A. So first you have uh, the uh, list of employees, and then you have the various functions within the program. There's the company. Put your company name in there. If you want to add an employee, you add it here, and then save. If you want to edit an employee, you double click the, the employee, employee selected, and then you edit him or her. And then you save. Now if you want to do a payroll for a particular employee, you double click on that employee. It says employee selected. Then you click payroll. Then the last payroll for is for 11020, so we're going to make this 11720. That's the next week. There you can put in salary, the rate, and regular hours and overtime hours, and any advances or friend of courts, any other deductions. And then when you're sure that's all right, you just go calc. Then you wait 10 seconds to let the system process. And we OK. And there we have the payroll for the employee. This is the date, the salary, and then Social Security, Medicare, federal withholding tax, state withholding, city, and this is the net, net, net pay. And if that all looks good, you just post. If you need to change something, you can go back and we post. Inserted successfully. And then you do it for the next employee. Employee selected. Payroll. The date is already changed. Then we calc. We wait 10 seconds. And we're okay with that. And there we have the verified payroll salary, taxes, and deductions. And then we post. And when you're done with all of them, you're basically done doing the uh, payroll for that week, or monthly or semi monthly. Uh, you look in taxes. This is what the period taxes that you pay for the week. We're doing it for 117. V the tax period. And there you can see the 941 taxes. So Social Security, Medicare, Federal Withholding, Total 941 in the state. And you have many other reports and taxes. You can do 941 taxes at the end of the quarter. State Unemployment Federal at the end of the year, W3 and W2. These are the tax tables that you have to fill in at the beginning of the year or which are filled in with the uh, copy of the payroll for the new year. We close that. We have reports. All kinds of reports. Income summary, departmental summary, pay, pay period, uh, period employee stubs. And then you have utilities. And we're going to restore what we had before. Don't want to leave any changes in there for the demo. And you can also do some of these utilities at the beginning of the year. You copy the employees from the last year. 
And that is basically the free WinPay 2020A free payroll for small businesses. Good luck.